I'm going to skull fuck your grandma. I said, one, two, three, all the kids bullied me, but they're not so cool. Now I shot up the school, yeah. So on YouTube, there is a thing to where if you make your video longer than 10 minutes, you will get more revenue. Now, personally, I have no problem with YouTubers getting more revenue in their videos. Actually, my videos aren't even monetized right now, so if you're seeing an ad on this video, that means I finally got with a good network because I'm trying to find a good network. There's, like, no good network. Every network I find is, like, 60 fucking 40. I'm like, no, you are not gonna have 40% of my money to fucking do nothing for me. Why would I allow you to have 40% of, like, all of my money? I don't make that much money on YouTube. I make like borderline nothing. And why would I allow you to have 40% of that? Why? That is the dumbest bullshit ever. Like, oh, you want you want to see my fucking dick? Oh, you want you want 40% of my dick. Only 4. You want 40% of my No, you're not going to have fucking 40% of my dick. I need every fucking inch. It's tiny, okay? It's fucking tiny. Okay. I I got off topic. Okay. So YouTubers have been making longer content so that they can get more money. It's understandable, right? Like a lot of the smaller YouTubers that are under a million subscribers don't make that much money. Like they honestly do not make that much money. So if they make a 10 minute video that's a high quality video, it's fucking amazing. I'm fine with it. But if you are one of these YouTubers that make a five minute video and then basically for the rest of the video, it's complete horseshit, trashy content. It's basically my fucking channel for five minutes long. Why would you want to produce something that isn't very high quality? Like, why would you just purposely make a shitty video just so you can get more money? I mean, hell, I know people are greedy as fuck, but you know, Jesus Christ, you don't need to have a 10 minute video to make money. Hey, watch your mouth. Perfect example. He makes some amazing videos videos and they're longer than 10 minutes so he probably places three to four ads on his videos as long as it doesn't have like fucking 20 ads in a video i'm good there are a lot of youtubers that are basically watering down their content just so they can make it longer just so they can get an extra 30 percent of their money i think when you add extra ads to your videos when you add two or three extra ads it can give you 40 percent more money so basically so leafy run he mentioned leafy get out evacuate while you can Oh god, no. Zora mentioned Leafy in a video. Oh god, no, no. He makes 10 minute long videos. Basically, all of them are 10 minutes long. And he gets like a million views per video. Like a thousand dollars. Now, take 30% of a thousand dollars. That is $300. And that is a lot more money. Would you rather make a thousand dollars or 1,300? That is a big difference. Like, I'm not gonna say Leafy's videos are bad because they're not. I just personally don't like them. He makes them 10 minutes long. And honestly, he has a formula for doing it. And the kids are probably a fucking millionaire by now. Like, Leafy probably will have to work for two more years. And then after that, he can just eat pizza and fucking jerk off all day. Sorsha is a perfect example. If you don't know who Sorsha is, she is a vegan Hitler. Go do it right now. Basically, she adds a thumbnail to the end of her videos. No matter if it's three minutes long or seven minutes long, she's gonna add her thumbnail for the rest of the video. There's no audio or anything. Just so she can get 10 minutes and just so she can get that extra money. Her videos get dislike bombed by PewDiePie fans, but she's made fucking tons of money now. Like, I think she stopped doing it after PewDiePie made a video on her basically criticizing her, saying, hey, you're a fucking scumbag for doing this shit. This is what pisses me off the most about this entire thing. A 10 minute long video will be higher in search results. It'll have, you know, more views. It'll have more money it'll just be a lot better of a video no matter what content it has in it this killed animations off youtube animations are borderline dead off youtube now because they would be like one to two minutes long and guess what they're not gonna get any more views they can't get in top search results anymore this fucking killed animation just so some person could water down their content and make an extra buck this is actually triggering me a lot of youtubers that i've been seeing have been starting to make 10 minute long videos scene is a perfect example he used to make great videos when they were three minutes long they were good funny moments video but now he makes very crappy content that's just 10 minutes long it's just feeding into the youtube algorithm it's just giving him more money and honestly i don't see why he wouldn't do it because he's getting more views he's getting more money he's getting more everything i don't hate youtubers that make videos purposely 10 minutes long just so they can get money i hate youtubers that water down their content just for money like, imagine if idub started making really shitty content what are you fucking gay just so they would be 10 minutes long. I'm pretty sure most of his videos are over 10 minutes long anyways, but just imagine if, you know, he normally had four minute videos, okay? And then he started watering down his content, making it a lot less, adding, you know, a lot more shitty things to it just so he could get extra money. That's what pisses me off about this whole thing. I'm fucking out. <laughs>